Donald Trump, anxious to win America with racism and fraud. Millions of deportees blood he wants with his careless sword. Every Muslim must pack bag and baggage and leave ports, or risk being shot with billions of fixed blood deep bullets hard and hot. The son of an orangutan with a squirrel on his head with no respect for diplomacy and rapport. The modern day vampire ancestor of Hitler, ready to suck dry the blood of the sofa to the last drop. Save the world from the unserious, divisive bully of a despot. Don't I jump, you too dumb. Everywhere you go, dumb, dumb, dumb. Why you don't dumb, sir? Everywhere you don't dumb. Oh my God, why you dumb, dumb, sir? Pull up right there. Yes, I greetings, greetings, Brag Rasta man out there. Bless and love, DJ Tough. Same blessings. I salute from afar, from a distance, you know. <laughs> yes, Respect, sir. my brethren. Love, love, love. Good. Good. We started like this. Where are you right now, my brother, in this world? I will do that introduction. Well, thank you so much, DJ Tuff, for having me. And big up Stefania, yeah. wherever you are, you know. Well, I'm in Accra, yeah. Ghana, the capital of Ghana, Accra. That's where I am right now. Wow. I'm at uh, a place called East Legon, Agra. East Legon. East Legon, right. Agra. Yeah. Greetings That's from right. Vienna, Austria, to the Gold That's Coast. Enough. Is it still the Gold Coast? <laughs> well, yes, we still have the gold, but the politicians are stealing all the gold, you know. But we still have it, you know. Wicked. Wickedness. <laughs> the poor people need the gold, man. <laughs> Keep That's the gold true. for my people, Mr. President. <laughs> yes, sir. So, Black Rasta, why you say Black Rasta? This name force, I would like you to define yourself. Because when you say Black Rasta, <coughs> me as a man, I see myself around there too. So, why Black Rasta? <laughs> well, I would just say that Black Rasta is simple because I am Rasta. And at the same yeah. time, I am a Black African. That's it. So a Rasta man mm -hmm. who is an African. Rasta Thank is you. all about blackness, yes. But the Rasta yes, that I am is an emphasis of mm -hmm. my blackness. So Black Rasta is my name. And uh, I got that when I was in the University for Development Studies. Uh, there was a wow. white man who came on campus and he had dreadlocks. Uh -huh. and students were yeah. like, hey, they say, Rasta man here, come out okay. and see your brother. And I came out and said, yes, <laughs> this is the white Rasta man. And I am the black yeah. Rasta man. And friends just Black Rasta man. Zid, respect that. It's interesting. You know, we have the white Rasta and the black Rasta. So <laughs> all see. our Rasta greetings out there. I don't know. Rasta. Happy to have you out there, my brother. So I will be very happy we hear something about the musical journey, the musical journey of Black Rasta. Please, take us on this journey, you know. The broader you make it, you're making it interesting for us. <laughs> Thanks, man. Blessed love. Tough. You Say, know, 
I started out with the music professionally in 1999. Mm. Yeah. But before 1999, I was on yeah. campus radio. I was yeah. also running around with music, performing left, right, and center here and there. And mm -hmm. I'll tell you, man, I went into the studio in 1999 to record my very first album. Wow. And mm -hmm. that was called The Rasta Shrine in 1999. And um, wow. as I told you before then, mm -hmm. I was performing on different, different student platforms, mm -hmm. singing the music wow. of Raskimono of Nigeria, mm -hmm. singing the music yeah. of some other artists. But professionally, I recorded my first album in 1999 mm -hmm. and I released it in 2000, April 2000. So it's been 21 yeah. years since the journey started for me uh, professionally. Wow. Yeah. But the album got recorded 2000. It was recorded in 1999 and released in April 2000. 2000 no of respect no of respect it's a long journey yes, yes. so since then how many albums you produce well i have 10 albums right now the last one is called timbuktu by road i have wow. the first album as um, the rasta shrine second mm -hmm. album uh more fire third more fire. album called ganja minister fourth yes, album sir. i mm -hmm. have this beautiful album called nati bongo from nati yes, bongo sir. I recorded the Naked Wire. From Naked wow. Wire, I came up mm -hmm. with an album called um, The Voice of the African Rebel. Then I also have uh, Born Dread. Born mm -hmm. Dread. I also Respect. have the Kuchoko Revolution. Mickey. I have uh, the Ancestral Moon Splash. And the mm -hmm. last one for now is called uh, Timbuktu. By road. In fact, I have an eleventh album, but I'll be releasing that later, 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 later. Okay, later, later this year, or are you talking about twenty twenty two? Well, we are waiting later. for the inspiration of the Most High, but it looks like it's going to land in twenty twenty two. Yes. 20. <laughs> Respect. We're looking forward to to that great album, Timbuktu by Road. Um, why Timbuktu by Road? It's like. Is it this journey we're taking from, you know, the Sahara, we're reaching out to foreign, or tell me something about that? <laughs> well, <laughs> well, this new album, we just, it, it was released in 2019, 2nd November, on the Imperial mm -hmm. Majesty Eilis Selassie Coronation Day. That was when mm -hmm. we released this album called Timbuktu by Road. Now, wow. why it's called Timbuktu by Road is, Bob Marley mm -hmm. has an album called Babylon by Bass. Bus, Which means yeah. we go into Babylon yeah. and we're using the bus. Yeah. But I looked at it and said, okay, this album is going to be called Timbuktu by road. We will go to yes. Timbuktu, the city of learning, and not yeah. Babylon, and not <laughs> by bus, but by road. No. We go through by the road. <laughs> we go through so many different countries so that we yes, pick sir. up all the good energies and the bad energies. We leave the bad mm -hmm. energies behind. And then we will dwell on the good energies and go to the city of Timbuktu, where we had our very first university in the world, the University of Timbuktu. Yo, interesting, you know, I heard of that too, like the world first university was Timbuktu. This is Mali, yes. em Songhai Empire, Timbuktu, this time. That's true. That's correct. Respect that. Beautiful Respect university. That. And we want to go wow. there. We want to take the people there on a journey to our first university ever to show the people mm -hmm. the archives, the ancient wisdom yeah. and all yeah. that. That's why the album is called Timbuktu by Road. And it has so many different kinds of African influence. Right now, mm -hmm. I am yeah. into a new kind of reggae music called mm -hmm. um, Kuchoko. And Kuchoko, Kuchoko is mm -hmm. the sound of authentic reggae music. When you are listening mm -hmm. to authentic reggae music, you hear kuchoko, kuchoko, bam, kuchoko, kuchoko, kuchoko bam, kuchoko, kuchoko, bam, kuchoko, kuchoko, you know? So I decided <laughs> to name this kind of music kuchoko. Yeah. It's reggae music, but we have added mm -hmm. a lot of African feel inside. Now you can hear mm -hmm. African dances, African mm -hmm. influences, African instruments yeah. in this kind of reggae mm -hmm. music, which I call mm -hmm. kuchoko. 
so that we can give the Jamaica. world an African mm -hmm. version of the Jamaican reggae. That's it. Respect that. Respect that. Wow, very interesting. Timbuktu, by you know, we call it by road. So, um, but the history we have to go in touch in that history there, you know, because Timbuktu, I think later, then the university was born down and many archives was born. Do you think we still have some some things out there we can research and bring out? Yes, yes, there's uh -huh. a lot. There's a lot mm -hmm. we can research. No two ways about mm -hmm. that. Yes, mm -hmm. some bad people went there, and there's even still fighting in Timbuktu. People are fighting mm -hmm. insurgency left, right, and center. We have rebels yeah. left, right, and center, mm -hmm. and all that. Mm -hmm. But a lot mm -hmm. of the archival material is still there. Yeah. By my research, Thank yes, you. they've destroyed a lot, but we still mm -hmm. have a lot of it. And the most Respect. important thing is that we still have some mm -hmm. walking libraries over there mm -hmm. in Timbuktu. People wow. who have studied okay. the thing and they have put the Thank thing you. in their, their mind. <laughs> they are human beings. Yes, yeah. they are still working in Timbuktu, the great sheikhs, the great mm -hmm. learned people and philosophers. Mm -hmm. We are ready to go there and replicate a lot of this material and Thank keep you. the university alive. Thank you. Respect that. That is a. Is it like how you talking, my brother? Is this a movement or this is your own only movement? You are, I know Black Rasta is a big movement, but is this an association or an organization? This I want to know now. How big is this? Well, it is. There is something that Black Rasta is initiating, but it's a movement for all of us Black people. Because right mm -hmm. now I'm hearing so many different mm -hmm. people say a lot of things. The African youth are now going to Europe in America to be able to go to university. Mm -hmm. If we are the first university mm -hmm. here, then we must be able to keep that university solid and powerful so that other people can mm -hmm. come in and learn from us. And if you read history, you realize that the yeah. Greeks, mm -hmm. Aristotle, Aesop, and a lot of them, Pythagoras and the rest, they came to Africa mm -hmm. to learn from mm -hmm. our great libraries yeah. and our great philosophers. Where are all those Thank libraries? You. Where are all those philosophers? Yeah. So we are researching mm -hmm. and bringing them forward so the world can mm -hmm. see that the African is brilliant. The African is yeah. wise. The African is powerful. Mm -hmm. The African can right. teach. The African still mm -hmm. has his roots intact. Thank yeah, you. Man. Respect that. The roots is there. Say, let's look out for the roots and, you know, <laughs> make it go on. Interesting. Um, the first song I was playing from you is called Doom Trump. And then I hear the relics say, you know, there will be peace, hopefully. Trump, do you think that we're going to get the peace? Trump is gone, but for me, you know, <laughs> it remained the same, this <laughs> politics. What will be your say on to that? <laughs> well, I understand that. American politics right. will always remain American politics, yes? It's mm -hmm. for the American people. But what happens mm -hmm. in America affects mm -hmm. us differently all over the world. When Barack yeah. Obama was coming, remember, I made a song for Barack Obama. Obama, wow. yeah, which was mm -hmm. big all over the world. It was on CNN, it was on BBC, wow. it was on mm -hmm. different, different networks. And Barack Obama came to Ghana. Yeah. And he wow. came to say thank you to me. We wow. met. <laughs> oh, yes, we took so many photographs. And you can check it out online. A photograph mm -hmm. of me and Barack Obama. I mean, wow. we had a very good time. You see? Respect. And mm -hmm. it was so beautiful. And that song... Wow was mm -hmm. big all over the world. In fact, we okay. released that song. That was the first song ever for Barack Obama. It came mm -hmm. before Coco T's song came out. And wow. a lot of people I'm... heard it around the world. See? Okay. And it goes like, Hey, mama, Please. mama, come back with taco. Come back with talk about Barack Obama. Papa, papa, come back with taco. Come back with talk about Barack Obama. Barack, Barack, Barack Obama, Barack, Barack, Barack Obama. Yeah. And Barack Obama loved the song so much. Yeah. When he won the wow. election, he came out. Uh -huh. The song came out in November 2017. So when he won wow. the election, mm -hmm. he came down mm -hmm. to Ghana because that was the wow. first song ever we made for him. He came to Wicked. Ghana, shook hands with me, yeah. and we had dinner together. Yeah. And we spoke about uh -huh. a lot of different things. Now, wow. when Trump was coming in, I realized that this man was nothing but a racist. First, he cut wow. away Muslims. 
He said Muslims mm -hmm. will not be allowed into America. He right. insulted the Pope and Catholics and so wow. many different things mm -hmm. that he did. He was not interested in black people. Africa, Africa asked Africa all. Asked all. I, don't know. I don't know. You know, and all that. And yeah. I felt that, yes, we know that American politics is American politics. But back when a man yeah. comes out flinging it in your face, you need to put them in yeah. their place. That's why I made dumb Trump. Thank you. Donald Trump, yes, you too dumb. Dumb. Everywhere you go, dumb, dumb, dumb. Why you dumb, dumb? So everywhere, dumb, dumb. Oh my God, why you dumb, dumb? So you know, that's it. Yes, sir. <laughs> Big song that you know. I was Big enjoying song. it. So I'm gonna play one of your songs when we come back. We talk about more history. You know, I wanna know about the Asantis out there. Asante. Asante Empire is in Ghana area, something like this. Right, correct. Asante, please. When you come, tell me something. After song high, tell me something about Asante. Then more come in the music. Listen this one, I think called Coffee Anan. Wow, big. Listen. <laughs> Sure. I'm gonna stop it right there. A thing called Coffee Anna and say go check it on all digital platforms. You don't know the voice of the man himself, Black Rasta. There, that's oh, an yeah. intro. You're gonna tell me about that song. Coffee Anna yeah. was the yeah. secretary. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Tell Corey, me something I'm about it. Did he legalize the ganja for us out in Ghana or Africa? <laughs> right now, it's been legalized, man. It's been legalized in Ghana. But at the time wow. that I was talking about the ganja, 10 years mm -hmm. back, 20 mm -hmm. years back, mm -hmm. some people were fighting as very bad. And they wow. even invited me to the Ghanaian mm -hmm. parliament house because mm -hmm. I was talking about ganja. I don't wow. smoke ganja. I've never smoked ganja. But I use wow. ganja for so many different <laughs> things, you know? I okay. use it for my dreadlocks. I wear jeans made out of marijuana fiber. Hum. And so wow. on and so forth. So when mm -hmm. people fight a herb that jam make, I feel yeah. sad. So I talked about oh. it, and the Ghana parliament was not happy about it. They invited me mm -hmm. to the parliament house. And, you know, it was a big thing all over Ghana. And you can also check that yeah. online. After the parliament mm -hmm. thing, I wrote this song, Kofi Annan Says. But the interesting thing mm -hmm. was that when I was talking mm -hmm. about this ganja thing, and they thought I was yeah. crazy because I'm Rasta. Kofi Annan, yeah. the Secretary General of yeah. the United Nations, himself came out right. and said, hey, what Black Rasta is saying is reasonable. Please, okay. legalize ganja. <laughs> and when he said wow. it, the whole world was shocked, especially Ghana. They were like, ooh, Black Rasta. Okay. Maybe yeah. Kofi Annan himself is smoking the ganja Black Rasta is smoking. That's what they said. Wow. So I made this song uh -huh. to say thank you to mm -hmm. Kofi Annan for supporting the good cause wow. of ganja. And today, mm -hmm. marijuana, ganja, yeah. is legalized yeah. in Ghana. Mm -hmm. Really? I never oh. know that, you know. I'm an African, but I didn't know that ganja is legalized in Ghana. Yes. Because Gambia is not legalized. <laughs> so, yes. Gambia, you hear that? Ghana. Senegambia, okay. Ghana legalized it. 
Senegambia or the rest of the Africa, rest of the world, please legalize it because here in Europe you can go buy it in the shops and now it's like you buying cigarettes on the road. It's called, you know, <laughs> you can buy it anywhere, anytime. So, and they, it can be, you know, you can make clothes like Rastaman saying everything is possible with the herb. So it's not about the smoking. They say the smokers even sometimes we abuse it and then, you know, <laughs> that's not helping. But Ganja has lots of things to deal with. Black Rasta, respect Rastaman. Bless you. Your music Bless is you. more political and so how will you call your own music what type of music you play because listening to all your songs is like it goes deep you know you have to be very brave to come up with them type of topic and yeah well Tell i'm a vessel the... that ja, ja is using you know any mm -hmm. kind of inspiration that comes from ja to me i put it out it doesn't matter what kind of message it is so i come mm -hmm. out because ja tell me to come out and if i come out mm -hmm. i don't look back or else mm -hmm. I will turn into a pillar of salt. You know, mm -hmm. I walk straight yes, and I make sure that mm -hmm. it happens. Yeah, so my mm -hmm. message is varied. It's about peace. It's about love. Yeah. It's about unity. Mm -hmm. And it's about yeah. some of the things that we have been miseducated about. So I sure. bring all mm -hmm. these things out into my message and I strike it Brilliant. hard. Yeah. To the point. Straight to the point. <laughs> Nail it. <laughs> Interesting. Yes, I... Good. So, me, I would love to know a little bit about the Asante Empire, you know. We talk about Songhai Empire, where the first world university is. Can you tell me something that the world don't know about the Asante Empire in Ghana? Gold all right, Coast? all right. Please. Well, I have a number of songs here in Ashanti language. One of the songs mm -hmm. on the Timbuktu by Road album, which mm -hmm. is an Ashanti song, is uh, mm -hmm. called Ejankaba. A janka ba, and that's in the a Ashanti Jankawa. language. But the Ashanti people are a great people, you know. The land yeah. of the Ashanti is full of gold. The king of the Ashanti, wow. we we mm -hmm. describe him in our appellations as mm -hmm. the king who sits on gold. Wow. The mm -hmm. king who sits on gold, and we say it here, Nana Otiko Koso. You know, mm -hmm. that means the king okay. who sits on gold. Now, the Ashanti trace their history all the way from the old Ghana Empire, where we had <laughs> Senegal, Gambia, wow. and the rest of wow. them, Mauritania, and all that. <laughs> and they came yeah. all the way down to this <laughs> part of the world now called Ghana. They first settled <laughs> in an area called uh, 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 what now we call Bono Ahafo, but Bono. Yeah. B-O-N-O -O was where they settled first. And then now yeah. they have come all the way to the Ashanti. Their capital uh -huh. is Kumasi. And it is a Kumasi. great empire. We all respect that empire. Right. Um, I don't know Ghana, but I heard of the Kumasi market. How is the Kumasi market out there? Hey, Kumasi is a big, <laughs> is the biggest market in West Africa. The Kegetia market, wow. the Kumasi market is the biggest. Okay. Or one of the biggest in the whole of West Africa. And that wow. market is so huge. You can find mm -hmm. everything. Everything we in can. that market you can find. I heard of that. I had a Ghana friend, a brother, who was telling me about Kumasi Market. So yeah. I'm looking forward to come to the Gold Coast and see Kumasi Market. You know, the Already. problem you give me, my brother, we have lots to talk about. But I delayed my time 30 minutes. So I, ha I have no, no complaints. But normally, I would love... I have thousands of your music i would love to play for the people but what we need to talk about too is a lot then the time one hour is kind of you know <laughs> tight here so well well, I would well love what to can still happen with you what more. can still happen is that you after our talk you can still play the music we finish our talk and Make then you vibes. play the music for the people thank you <laughs> Wicked. I will do that for you people out there. Later, I'm going to DJ. I have more of black Rasta music. I'm going to play Rasta. for you people. So we, we stay with the music and the political situation in Africa. Now I go to Uganda. My brother, Bobby Wine, you have a song with Bobby Wine? Yes. 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 Tell me the, the link between you and Bobby Wine. Is just artists you link or there is a different type of connection? Well, it's, it's, it's everything. You, you, you know what Bobby Wine is doing in Uganda? Thank you. It's almost the same thing I'm doing in mm -hmm. Ghana. I don't like politicians wow. stealing from the people and deceiving the people. So I lash out against politicians mm -hmm. bad. And everybody knows that. 
Sometimes mm -hmm. I get into trouble, but yeah. most of the time, mm -hmm. I know that I'm guided by, yeah. by Jah. The Almighty takes care of me. Sure. So somebody mm -hmm. spoke with me and said, well, I can link you out with Bobby mm -hmm. Wine because you people have the same mind mm -hmm. so you can work together. Wow. And that's it. I got mm -hmm. in contact with uh, mm -hmm. a Bobby Wine and the result is what cool. we have here. In fact, mm -hmm. one of the results mm -hmm. is what we are because we can do yeah. things more than just music. More things music, yeah. to free the minds of our mm -hmm. people, move the people towards right. accepting amount of consciousness. Mm -hmm. That is what we're looking at. Yeah. But Bloody Museveni is a collaboration between mm -hmm. me and Bobby Wine. And Bobby Wine loves the song. Yeah. And as I said, mm -hmm. it's a big song in Uganda, mm -hmm. in Ghana. It's almost an anthem in Uganda right now. Because there's a dangerous wow. man in Uganda called Yoweri Kabuta yeah. Museveni, who is killing the people of Uganda. Really? He came in like a yeah. peacemaker. But the man is a very mm -hmm. bad man abducting people right yeah. now, killing the youth. What kind of a leader is that? Mm -hmm. We don't want a leader like that. No. We want conscious leaders. We don't want wicked leaders mm -hmm. who are killing our mm -hmm. own people. We need to cut mm -hmm. them out and let better yeah. leaders come up. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You hear that, my people of Uganda? I don't know much. I don't know much about politics, but what I will say is like, after some years, you know, maximum should be 10 years, five years, if that's not enough, 10 years for every president run two terms should be enough, you know. But they want to be there like, you know, we had that trouble in Gambia 22 years. Even they are strong that lately make them weak because you lose your, you know, power grid, take it over. And then, yeah, you deceive the people. And I think the same trouble happening in Uganda, I will tell Mr. Sveni to give the chance to the young ones out there, man. <laughs> we see it more brighter. Yes, yeah. I black rascal. Yeah. Good. Um let's 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 stick to the music still, you know. Well, let's stick to the music. Um yeah. Do where apart from Africa, Ghana, which places are you performing? Well, I perform in so many different places, and I'm still looking are performing in so many other different places you know i have performed in america several times wow. in america i have performed okay. in guyana you know mm -hmm. i performed in guyana so many different Good. parts of guyana from georgetown all the way yeah. to you know Berbies, mm -hmm. all those places yeah. about performances and i've mm -hmm. also performed all over africa mm -hmm. a number of countries in africa like nigeria like wow. um yeah. Yeah. In, oh, yeah. You know, different wow. own homeland. And I've also uh -huh. performed in uh, different, different, different parts of Ghana. In fact, yeah, different parts okay. of Ghana I performed. And I performed abroad as well. Like I told you, America, Guyana. Wow. I've also Thank performed you. in all these countries. Uh, We're looking forward to see you in Europe. You know? <laughs> uh -huh. Yes, I performed in um, uh, Zimbabwe. Robert Mugabe invited me in 1992. Hey. 1992, <laughs> yes. He invited me. Uh, yeah. No, not 1992. He invited me for his 92nd birthday, 92 years. Yeah. I was there yeah. in wow. Uh, wow. Zimbabwe. And I performed for the president. Okay. And I performed for the people of Zimbabwe yeah. at the Zima. That's the Zimbabwe Music oh. Awards. I performed in South Africa yeah. as well. I love South Africa. Mm -hmm. I love Thank Africa. You. You know, mm -hmm. I love the world. Mm -hmm. So, yes, I'm still looking. I think our ex, our ex president didn't hear about you, didn't know about you, then he will just book you out. You know, yeah, yeah, yeah do you sure. know about him? <laughs> yes, it's not too late. We're still looking forward to performing in Senegal. We're looking forward Definitely. to performing in, in fact, all African countries and Europe yeah. everywhere. Yes. Big time. <laughs> Big time. This is good. It's a good something, and then the world will. Yeah, we will we will love to hear you and see you live in a you know I mean this side of Probably. Europe. We're looking forward to see you mm -hmm. soon. Great. Um, when it comes to the music, how is the reggae music done in Ghana? Is it for you doing this music for all these years? Do you think we are moving forward, or is just something need to be done fixed urgently right now? Then we can move on. Can you give us something? about that you can expand it even to the whole Africa, how we could, you know, 
get level well, in this market we'll because Afrobeat is big, mm -hmm. big, 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 mm -hmm. big, big. Uh, right now, mm -hmm. reggae music and dancehall, biggest mm -hmm. in Ghana. We have mm -hmm. such artists as uh, Shatawale, we have Stone Boy, mm -hmm. and some other artists who are mm -hmm. making it big right here in Ghana and mm -hmm. around Ghana. You know, dancehall mm -hmm. and reggae, they are together. Mm -hmm. And the mm -hmm. dancehall aspect of the music is so big in Ghana, mm -hmm. we are also pushing our reggae uh, for the mm -hmm. more conscious people who like to hear the one drop, yeah. chunk, chunk, sure. boom, mm -hmm. chunk. Chunk boom, kuchako, kuchako boom, kuchako, kuchako boom. Yeah, we are doing that for the purists, and we're doing that for a lot of people who want to come to the dance and skank and smoke their mm -hmm. herb and you know do a whole heap of different things. So yeah, mm -hmm. it's big. Ghana dance hall is so huge, so big. Wow. And yeah, some other parts of uh, uh, Africa, Gambia, I know mm -hmm. is big. Ivory Coast reggae mm -hmm. is number one, and yes. Mm -hmm. Wow. Africa, okay. yeah, man, is still holding on to good reggae music. It's happening. Okay, me, I will say, okay, because now you call some names like Sata, um, you get Stone Boy when it comes to Ghana, you know, and then Black Rasta doing the reggae. Me, I will say, okay, you, or the world is like the Afro beats is more out there than the reggae. What will you say on to that? Yeah, it is very true. It is very true. Mm -hmm. Afro beats mm -hmm. right now. It's on top. And that's one mm -hmm. very good thing about reggae music. Other genres sure. come, they rise, they are mm -hmm. there, and then mm -hmm. they simmer, and reggae is still there. Mm -hmm. Reggae is like the foundation. Yeah, there. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Yes, so that right. is why we are doing the kuchoko. Yeah. When you listen to the kuchoko, yeah. you would hear a lot of uh, the Afro beats inside, as done yeah. by Fela, but you still hear yeah. the reggae music. Like, I have a dance yeah. song there, which I love so much. It's called Jamila on this album. Jamila, Jamila mm -hmm. yes, it is there. It's called Jamila. And uh, mm -hmm. we also have Nubian Woman. Nubian. Oh. You hear the dance soul and you hear the talking drum. Mm -hmm. You know, in dance soul. Yeah. And you feel that, no, this is crazy. This is beautiful. Wow. So wow. you hear that. We are bringing in the Afrobeat. The reggae is yeah. already there. And giving out to the exactly. people, and we're calling it kuchoko. Yes, kuchoko. And he has a something new. <laughs> yes. Something new. All right, that's interesting. Coming out of Ghana, something kuchoko. Check it out. <laughs> yeah. Um, that's gonna be. Can you give me please a cappella in this Asante Uchok something something style? We hear. I wanna hear the As Asante how it sounds out there with this song. If no possible, problem please. at all. Thank now. You. Uh, we have this one called Ejan Kaba. Ejan Kabe. Eya sema wana bekama. Missy Ejan Kabe. Eya sema wana bekama. Fau jija. Eya sema no biya ke biya ma. Fau jija. Eya sema no biya ke biya ma. That's a sound. Sure. But remember, yes. in Ghana, we have about 200 different languages. Wow. I come sure. from the Dagomba area, and I have mm -hmm. a lot of songs in the Bani, you know, mm -hmm. like this one mm -hmm. called Gafara. Gafara mm -hmm. is Gafara. another beautiful song from Black Rasta. And wow. Gafara simply means, I'm sorry. It's I'm sorry. originally from the Arabic, I'm yeah. sorry. And I sing you mm -hmm. a little bit of the Dagbani, in fact, they were the first people to actually inhabit Ghana. The Dagomba wow. people, they were the first to mm -hmm. come to this part of country called Ghana, be long before the Ashanti. You know? Wow. And, mm -hmm. Yes, and it goes like, like this. Nsuri agafara chalia pangma mbane umma ina mwondwa umma Bula bal kable dal konyaro yenga denzo guweyo Mbagi kale Gafara, gafara, chali ya pangma Unkula mpai na wanzogo Biso ngo mpogo no wakari yikase Muna samde chamdwa resa kamya Na mama gafara <laughs> Jafara, yes, <laughs> sounds heavy, you know. <laughs> I'll tell you Rastamad. something. Jimmy Cliff was in Ghana. Jimmy wow. Cliff came to Ghana, and you know the Ashanti mm -hmm. is the most popular in Ghana. 
but there were wow. other ethnic groups there were other peoples mm -hmm. who came long before the ashantis and wow. the, the gomba okay. were the first to inhabit ghana mm -hmm. some people say wow. the guan and so on and so forth but history will tell us that it is the Dagomba. Jimmy Cliff mm -hmm. came and he was able to make it beyond Accra. He went to wow. Kumasi and then he went mm -hmm. to the northern region where I come from and he met okay. with the Dagombas. And Jimmy Cliff uh -huh. said, you know what? I've met so many different people in Ghana and I think that we wow. Jamaicans are actually from the Dagomba. That's what he said. Dagunka. Wow. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's broad, you know, Asante, Bobo, Asantis are like Moko. Uh, tell me something about that repatriation. How is it going um, in Ghana? Because I was just talking with Sister Carol the other day. she been to Gambia before Ghana even, but she's like, okay, if I will choose something, maybe Ghana. And I see Rita Mali, all of these people are out there. How is the repatriation accepted by the government can you tell me something about that and how yes. we should do to welcome our brothers and sisters back home mm -hmm. for real it's big it is the biggest thing mm -hmm. right now for me as a pan-africanist mm -hmm. everybody's coming mm -hmm. to ghana right now you just heard um steve wanda saying that he wants to come wow. to ghana we have so mm -hmm. many different people coming to ghana hollywood superstars mm -hmm. ghana is a free country Ghana is a country that wow. encourages press freedom, freedom of speech. Wow. Ghana is so beautiful. Yes, we have problems, but when you look at yeah. other African countries, comparing that mm -hmm. to Ghana, you realize that mm -hmm. Ghana is paving a strong way for all these countries. I'll tell you something. Wow. Now, the year wow. of return, what you call repatriation, had so yeah. many people come in. People like yeah. Muta Baruka, Rastakura from Jamaica, and a mm -hmm. lot more. Tony Rebel, mm -hmm. they've all been to Ghana and they appreciate wow. the kind of link Ghana has. Remember, cool. Ghana is the home of Kwame Nkrumah, the great Pan-Africanist. Mm -hmm. So when you come home, yes, sir. Rest in peace. you will realize that there's a certain kind of spirit that links up Ghana to the diaspora. Remember during our Big independence time. in 1957, Kwame Nkrumah made it mm -hmm. clear to the whole world that our independence mm -hmm. as Ghana is nothing, it's meaningless, unless it is sure. linked up with the total liberation, the total freedom of the whole okay. Africa, Senegal, mm -hmm. Togo, so, Ivory Coast, Mauritania, right. all African countries have mm -hmm. to be liberated before the independence of Ghana will be yeah. meaningful. So because of so, that, mm -hmm. now when slavery mm -hmm. was happening, we had a mm -hmm. gate of no return. And a lot of slaves mm -hmm. or free African people were taken out of Ghana more than any other country mm -hmm, in Africa. Definitely. This is history. Because we are the wow. biggest port for slaves. The biggest uh -huh. port, yes, for slaves okay. was in Ghana. And they wow. carried a lot of people from Senegal, from Togo, from yeah. Mali, all over. They passed yeah. through Ghana. Mm -hmm. At that time called something Ghana, else. Yeah. The port, that's what they used. Mm -hmm. So they had the gate of no yeah. return. Once you enter that gate, wow. you don't come back. They carried mm -hmm. you to slavery. Come back. Now, through the gate of sure. no return, we have turned it mm -hmm. into the gate of return. Through the year return. of return. So when people come, wow. we take them to the gate and we let them pass through the gate, symbolically returning sure. to Ghana. We have political oh. issues, no problem. We have politicians who are thieves and liars. We have yeah. politicians mm -hmm. who don't speak the truth, just like any other mm -hmm. country in the world. But yeah. we are staying on the mm -hmm. positive and keeping Ghana mm -hmm. more solidly positive mm -hmm. wow good one um jamaicans they are like okay in in ethiopia somebody was telling me a different side of that story you know someone will tell you before like sasamani land was given to rasta people by Selassie. but not lately this year i had a different version of it so I don't know with Ghana what will be the plan. Is there how the government will one time say, okay, we have this land, this area for our people who want to come back home? Are you giving them a special space area or they are just in in inside the community? Can you tell me how that repatriation structure is working out there? Beautiful question. You see, the Shashamani thing, mm -hmm. yes, highly Selassie gave the land of Shashamani for mm -hmm. people to return, Rasta. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And all other people in the so-called diaspora to return. He did it. Mm -hmm. It is just the indigents 
Now they are fighting in Ethiopia and all that. They are those going against the dictates and the pronouncements of Haile Selassie. Remember when mm -hmm. Haile Selassie was even here with us? Some mm -hmm. people were still fighting him and overthrew him and did a lot of things. Mm -hmm. Definitely. If the man himself was overthrown, how about his mm -hmm. words? So true, he sure. gave the land to Rasta to return and other people. Yeah. But the people are going against the words of Haile Selassie. I leave that okay. when I come to Ghana. Yes, the mm -hmm. Ghanaian government is giving citizenship to people who want to return home. When you okay. come, they give you a citizenship and wow. then they will direct you yeah. to where you can get land cheaply yeah. to buy. Yeah. They try Country. to support you with so many yeah. different things. But I tell you this also. Mm -hmm. I realized and I told the Ghanaian government, and if I don't tell you, I'll be a hypocrite. I realized yes. that mm -hmm. the people that they were encouraging to come into the country, the mm -hmm. Ghanaian government was more interested in the money that they would bring to Ghana. Bring it. Mm -hmm. Yes. They are thinking mm -hmm. about how the people will bring money, just like the mm -hmm. American Lotto visa. Wow. When you mm -hmm. win the visa and they realize that you are a useless man in your country, you are a drunkard, yeah. you have no money, you have nothing, you have nothing to contribute yeah. to the American uh society yeah. you will never get the mm -hmm. visa you will remain in your country so they ask wow. you if you're a mm -hmm. chain smoker they ask you if you drink mm -hmm. a lot of alcohol they ask you what mm -hmm. kind of job you have what kind of mm -hmm. expertise you have it's almost yeah. the same thing with the ghana one but the, the mm -hmm. difference is not that much when you mm -hmm. are coming in they want to find out what business mind you have what opportunities yeah. you want to come and explore Bring. in the country you see yeah. They are mm -hmm. not asking you to come and connect yeah. with the ancestral spirit. And that's what I told okay. the Ghanaian government. Don't yeah. do that. If you are asking mm -hmm. people to come in, ask them to mm -hmm. genuinely come in and connect with the mm -hmm. African spirit. Let them come mm -hmm. in and connect with the people. Mm -hmm. Let them come mm -hmm. in. When they come mm -hmm. in and settle, whatever mm -hmm. they want to come there and do business-wise would only mm -hmm. be an addition. When they move right. in, they will never mm. believe their investments anywhere if they see that this is a better place. They are home. So don't Definitely. bring investment first. Bring mm -hmm. the people coming in mm -hmm. to be with us first. Mm -hmm. Unite the mm -hmm. people. Accept the mm -hmm. people. Welcome the mm -hmm. people. Let them feel mm -hmm. at home. And every yeah. other thing will settle in you good feel place. Home. Definitely. That's very, that's very important and interesting, you know. This is, this is good. Um, yeah. Let me play a short song for the listeners out there. When we come, we talk about the music. And then, yeah, we have some minutes to go. Still, black, black, black. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes, I love me, man, love me, oh, love me, me, la la, ye, kaku ni a be. Itu mana wuni, ashe la la, ashe la la, kaku ni a be. Yes, Zaya, I'm going to stop it right there. It's called Aselala, Aselala. Which language is that Rasta, man? <laughs> well, this is the, the Bani. This is the Gomba. And it means, wow. oh, mm -hmm. so is that how it is? That's what it means. Is that how it is? Mm -hmm. And in this song, mm -hmm. I am asking, is this how the world is? I was living mm -hmm. with my lover, my beautiful mm -hmm. wife. Mm -hmm. Then we had so many good plans. We will build mm -hmm. another house. We will have children, mm -hmm. we would have a backyard mm -hmm. garden, we will mm -hmm. live happily, mm -hmm. and so on and so forth. Only for mm -hmm. me to wake up the next day, and I'm waking up my lover, and she is not turning around. She is wow. not talking. She is dead. Interested. And I'm asking, is this how the world is? You make mm -hmm. plans, and sure. all of a sudden, the plans are mm -hmm. dashed away just like that. Sure. That is what the song is talking about. Sakina, is this how the world is? Today I'm waking oh. you up. And this is a true story, you know. Oh, I had a wife called me, Sakina. Mm -hmm. Yes, and we were living together nicely. Everything was okay. We planned to do mm -hmm. so many things. And all of a sudden... Mm -hmm. 
I woke up one mm -hmm. day and Sakina, wake mm -hmm. up. We have to go and do our thing. Mm -hmm. Sakina, wake up. Sure. She was not turning. Mm -hmm. But this was a very oh. obedient woman. You touch her once, she'll be up. She would even get up before you wake up. Today she was sure, sleeping. Right. I was mm -hmm. calling. And when I mm -hmm. tried to turn her around, I realized mm -hmm. that, nah, life it's is gone. Rest in peace. So mm -hmm. life so. is sad. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. Wow. Rest in peace. Rest in peace, Serena, and all we love ones out there. Yeah. Wow. Let's 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 stick to the music out there in Ghana. So what will be your um message, not only Ghana, but to the whole African upcoming singers? What should be the way forward? Which type of message, you know? Give for some teachings as a man like you, Black Rasta, please. I like that. Thank you so much. You see. Welcome. If you are a reggae singer, right now mm -hmm. the reggae market is so choked. Mm -hmm. And some of us Africans are not even accepted by Jamaicans. Mm -hmm. I have toured around the world. I've met a lot of Jamaican artists. Mm -hmm. And when they ask mm -hmm. you what kind of music you're doing, let's be honest. Mm -hmm. And you tell them mm -hmm. reggae. Mm -hmm. They don't seem to be really happy that you're doing reggae. They feel that you're trying to take away the reggae Excellent. from them. Mm -hmm. You are trying mm -hmm. to, 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 to take their food out of their mouths. They ask mm -hmm. you to go do some other African thing. Go do Afrobeat. Mm -hmm. Go do something. But I'm happy that mm -hmm. Afrobeat is here and a lot of Jamaicans are coming into it. So as an mm -hmm. African artist, please, yeah. please mm -hmm. put a lot of your culture in your reggae music. Mm -hmm. If sure. Bob Marley was alive, I am yeah. sure he'll be adding some African flavor a lot Big into time. his music. Big Remember time. when Bob Marley was going to add a rock guitar to his reggae? Mm -hmm. A lot of Jamaicans said mm -hmm. he was spoiling the reggae. You know? Eh. Bob Marley was uh -huh. a man who was so progressive. So wow. African artists, please, reggae music is beautiful, but yeah. put your identity into it. If you cannot speak Patwa, mm -hmm. that's not me. you cannot do reggae music. Right now, all over mm -hmm. Africa, all reggae mm -hmm. artists want to speak Patwa. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it's like a Jamaican man trying to speak Ashanti. It's mm -hmm. like a Jamaican trying to speak difficult. the Bali. They will mm -hmm. not be able to speak it exactly Dialect. the way we speak it as people who were born mm -hmm. with it. Right. Definitely. Oh my God. Definitely. My power just Definitely. went off, man. We good, we good. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I'm going to play oh a song God. before you come. We will need you back here, Black Rasta. We're not ready yet. All right. <laughs> yes, sir. Uh, no. This one is sweet. 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 This one is Mugabe, oh, Mugabe, pull up that he don't know. Rest in peace, Mugabe, and all of his loved ones don't know. Black Rasta there, live on direct. Yes, I <laughs> good. Um, I couldn't get myself where we just cut it, but if you can start it from there, <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Yeah, I'm sorry about that, you know. It just went up. You were it's asking good. me to talk to the African yeah. artists. African Definitely. artists who yeah. are into Thank reggae you. music or want to do reggae music or something. Thank Whatever you, you mm -hmm. do, you mm -hmm. just have to make sure that, mm -hmm. yes, uh, mm -hmm. you put in your culture. Yeah, You let Thank your you. culture come in right. and yeah. you make sure that, yes, yeah. mm -hmm. You bring in your sights and sounds. Wicked. You make sure that you put mm -hmm. in a lot of things in there so mm -hmm. that other people will see that, yes, you are an African mm -hmm. and everything yeah. is working according to plan. Bring Doing in the, your yeah. local mm -hmm. dialects. Sure. Also bring in your sights and sounds. Mm -hmm. Bring in 
a mm -hmm. lot of the things mm -hmm. that other people do not get elsewhere into your reggae mm -hmm. music. And once you do that, mm -hmm. there is no way you would fall apart. Mm -hmm. Not two ways about mm -hmm. that. Put in your language. That's right. why Alpha Blondie keeps flying yeah. higher and higher night and day. See? Lucky do night same and way, day, no? Alpha Blondie is <laughs> flying. Yeah. Yes, Definitely. Alpha Blondie is flying. He's right. singing in his own right. dialect. He's doing a lot of different things. And he's so yeah. big. Wow. So we are That's encouraging right. other <laughs> African people to do the same. For real. Mm. Thank you. Yeah. Good thing. Respect <laughs> that, you know. Um, Black Rasta there. If anybody have a question for my artist before he go, we are already kill his time, but I will keep that that 15 minutes for you people. If anybody have a question, just forward it. Come. But yeah, before then, then Black Rasta just yeah, tell us um about this African Unite, you know. Me personally, okay, I'm like after years, I'm like Africa Unite, Africa Unite, Africa Unite. But see my own surrounding, I'm like, my people don't see still and they don't hear, so it's a difficult something. What will be your say on to that? Do you think we will reach out there after Kwame and Kurma Patli Suumba, all these people? You know, pass away saying these things and still we are kind of, you know, fighting against ourselves. Can you tell me something, please? From your opinion. Yes. Africa is surely going to unite. Okay. Nkrumah did it to a certain point. Other people mm -hmm. continued. Thomas mm -hmm. Sankara did it and a lot mm -hmm. more. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Sheikh Amadou Bamba, mm -hmm. he did his. Akasa. Akasa. Mm -hmm. My brother, mm -hmm. many more African people are now mm -hmm. more alert now than they were mm -hmm. several years ago. Thank you. So African mm -hmm. unity is a must. There's okay. nothing we can do. That unity is mm -hmm. arriving. Why is it that okay. people like Steve Wonder want to come mm -hmm. to Africa? Yeah. Why mm -hmm. is it that the whole world is now looking up to Africa? Okay. China is running to Africa, left, right, and center. Now, everywhere you go yeah. in Africa, you see more Chinese than even Africans. Wow. You see? Right now. That yeah. tells you that the world is coming mm -hmm. to Africa. Mm -hmm. We need more conscious yeah. leaders, and yeah. the unity of Africa is a must. It's going to happen. Mm -hmm. Let us all continue. We should never lose hope. My brother, yeah. it uh -huh. is going to happen live and coming. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah man. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> you motivate me. So there is a way out. My brother says it's a process in Salazia. And Kwame and those people come. Black Rasta is here and the orders to keep that war going on. So it's something, something possible. Definitely. My people unite, organize, and centralize. And then, you know, <laughs> yes, sir. It's very interesting. Repatriation is happening. Econ is even trying to build a city in Senegal. So I think that will, yes. you know, yes. check the eye of many, many, many uh, big people in the United States to come back to Africa. For real. Thank you. Thank you, my brother. So, yes, yeah, sir. give us uh, what's coming, you know, like 2020 was not too easy with performance and the music. But you, I know still, you know, many artists is like studio times are happening, recordings. How was it for you? And now as we enter in 2021, how is it for you, Black Rasta? Can you Well, it started a... on a very, a very nice note. That was when mm -hmm. I released the Timbuktu by Road album. And we're getting mm -hmm. ready with the fans to go mm -hmm. all the way to Timbuktu. We had five wow. buses of people who wanted to really? go on a pilgrimage from Ghana to Timbuktu. Wow. But the virus wow. came in and we have to put everything <laughs> on hold. I could not even wow. talk, not even once. <laughs> we released the album on November 2, 19, 2019. And from wow. that time, and I'm glad to tell <laughs> you that Timbuktu by Road album, it, <laughs> it, 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 it debuted at number <laughs> 76 on the best reggae albums of the world on iTunes wow. UK. Respect. We got Salute. that, and it is very mm. positive. Now we wow. have all the energy on stage. Now it mm -hmm. looks like the virus is coming down, and we will have to sure. go out and show the world the energy mm -hmm. that we have gathered yeah. all along. Mm -hmm. But I'm happy to also say that it gave me time to go into the studio and record another yeah. whole album. 
within mm -hmm. eight months, I wow. recorded a whole album. Full I album. even have a collaboration <laughs> on this mm -hmm. album with Tiken Jaffa yeah. Kohli. Poor, that's big. Okay. Yes. <laughs> that's big. We have a collaboration. You have all our bigger soldiers, Bobby White, Tiki Jaffa Kohli, Alpha Blonding, yes. then, you know. Alpha Blonding is coming up <laughs> <You're> next. <laughs> wow, we're looking forward to that. It will be something great. I'm personally, Already. I'm happy to know Black Rasta out there. My designer is a Ghanaian who do all the designs for me here in Austria. So I'm in contact with my Ghana people. I'm like, okay, I have two designers, one in Gambia, one in Ghana. But my Ghana <laughs> one is a professional. So <laughs> he get more works from me. You know, cause our brother is a brother and we are all in this struggle. Then we need to connect with self and organize, unite. Then there's a brighter and a better future. Yes, Black Rasta, just anything you want to say to your fans and the world listening right now, just give us some advice in this time we live in, you know, because time is not All the right. same. You know? <laughs> All right. So to the people of Uganda, let's uh -huh. unite Thank and you. kick out anybody, every person who is not bringing in unity amongst you. Mm -hmm. It doesn't mm -hmm. matter whether they are tall or they are short. Remember, mm -hmm. we have a brand new song out with Bobby Wine, mm -hmm. my brethren. Mm -hmm. And it is called Bloody Museveni. Museveni right. is not a leader. He's a killer. What a dictator. Oh, Uganda, kick out this leader. He's a killer. What a dictator. Let us all come together yes. and make Africa a better place. Thank you. Let us all come together and love Africa more because Africa has shown mm -hmm. us all the love. I remember mm -hmm. I have another brand new song called Cameroon. Mm -hmm. You know, my Pan African is anywhere in Africa there's a problem. Mm -hmm. Anywhere in Africa that needs wow. my support, I oh. give it out wholeheartedly. I have a song mm -hmm. called Cameroon. Mm -hmm. And when you go to wow. Cameroon, it's both Anglophone and Francophone. There's mm -hmm. another terrible leader there. His name is Paul Bia. Wow. Terrorizing mm -hmm. the people. Mm -hmm. Bringing forth mm -hmm. Ambazonia that is ready to break away from Cameroon. Sure. What we want is unity. What mm -hmm. we want is love. Kama Cameroon, why? Kama Cameroon, why? Why my Cameroon? Why my Cameroon? Kama Cameroon, why? That's it. Yes, Telling the people Make to it. unite. DJ Taf, I want to say thank yes, you sir. so much for having me. I love and uh -huh. respect you. The dress you are wearing is so beautiful. I believe yeah. it's coming from your Ghana uh, designer. Yeah. That design is so beautiful. <laughs> I love it. Big up thank the Ghana you. designer. Big up the whole of Africa. Yeah. Big up Stefania. Yes, Big up DJ yeah. Taf. I salute thank you, my you. brother. Respect. I salute you. I salute you. Before you go, you touched this pan African twice. You were saying it. Me as an African, I know that there is pan-African organiz organization. And I know that, okay, Gambia, even before I left, we have some people they call pan-African. Sometimes they are traveling in the other part of Africa. How is this pan-African union in Africa? Can you tell us something? And if somebody want to be part of this, how it is going? Tell me something about is, that, please. There is and a big movement right now. Mm -hmm. Reggae is all about pan-Africanism. Pan-Africanism... It's very simple. Mm -hmm. Making mm -hmm. African people stand mm -hmm. independent. Mm -hmm. yeah. You see, what Ghana that... president mm -hmm. said, mm -hmm. I said Pan-Africanism simply means mm -hmm. African people, black people, mm -hmm. should mm -hmm. be economically independent. Sure. Whatever we want to eat, we can eat that. Whatever we want to drink, everybody mm -hmm. should be able to drink and eat whatever they want to drink and eat. Mm -hmm. That is what Pan-Africanism is about. Self-pride. That mm -hmm. is what it is. And it is the biggest thing in Africa right now. Pan-Africanism. Mm -hmm. Everybody's wow. talking about independence. And I'm talking mm -hmm. about economic independence. Political mm -hmm. independence. Ghana mm -hmm. president has been talking about it. Africa mm -hmm. beyond aid. Ghana beyond mm -hmm. aid. We have all the gold. Mm -hmm. We have all the mm -hmm. diamond. Yet, yeah. mm -hmm. when the vaccines came out, Ghana was mm -hmm. the first to get the vaccines. Just because yeah. Ghana agreed to say that Ghana is the poorest country in the world, or one of the <laughs> poorest countries in the world. 
sorry. <laughs> which is yeah. very sad. Before right. you mm-hmm. get help from those people, they mm-hmm. want you to demean yourself, insult mm-hmm. yourself. You remember mm-hmm. Hippic, highly indebted, mm-hmm. poor countries. They mm-hmm. want you to accept that you are highly indebted. You are mm-hmm. poor before mm-hmm. they will give you aid. Sure. Before mm-hmm. they give you any food to eat, they want you to tell the whole world that you are useless, you mm-hmm. cannot find your own food, and they have to come mm-hmm. and give you food. In my language, okay. Dagbani, we mm-hmm. have a song mm-hmm. from childhood. Everybody sings it. And the song yeah. simply says, if you will give me and insult me later, then keep mm-hmm. your food. Done. I don't want it. Sure. Mm-hmm. Ay. Every child is singing this song. Mm-hmm. Give me and insult me mm-hmm. later, but African mm-hmm. presidents yeah. continue to take the insults, mm-hmm. accept that they are useless in mm-hmm. order to get vaccines. I'm so Thank sad you. that Magufuli had to die in Tanzania, mm-hmm. but he was such a great uh, president. Definitely. He did so in well for time. his people. His spirit mm-hmm. continues to live. We love mm-hmm. him wherever mm-hmm. he is. Mm-hmm. We pray that mm-hmm. his soul rests in peace, but he was a mm-hmm. very mm-hmm. great president, and we need mm-hmm. more of the Magufulis. He had his own sure. issues, he had his mm-hmm. own weaknesses, but yeah. he was mm-hmm. above all no a great perfect. president. Mm-hmm. And we mm-hmm. are looking forward to having that. Gambia, mm-hmm. Yaya Jame, mm-hmm. was mm-hmm. also good until he overstayed. He was a Thank great you. guy. He did so many is I remember way, when no? HIV AIDS came. Yeah. He behaved in another way. Mm-hmm. Yaya Jame Definitely. was great. I love Gambia. Yeah. Reggae Gambia. is big in Gambia. Presently, big I'm time, even yeah. talking to a Gambian artist. His, yeah. his name just escaped me. Um, I'm trying to remember Reggae his name. Artist. He's based in Germany. Reggae he, artist he based, based in Germany now. Germany. Germany. Germany, yes. Oh, he used to be um, in France, but he's not yeah. in Germany. Rebellion, yes. the recaller, no. Rebellion. That's him, the recaller. recaller Rebellion, the recaller. You know him. <laughs> yes, yes, he's our legend, you know. <laughs> oh, my God. We are working on a collaboration right now. Wow. The brother is a very brilliant brother. Yes, he's a great Definitely. brother. I love him. And together... Wow. We will stop uh-huh. Gambia and do a lot of things. We can, He's a brother we that can. I love and respect so much. Yeah, yeah. man. And tell you when it comes to the Gambia. Mm-hmm. Yes, yeah. powerful. On. I used to love yeah. this brother called Demba Konta. Right. Demba Konta from Gambia. <laughs> yeah. I have always loved him. United Africa, States of United Africa. United States of Africa. Africa, right. Gambian children. Right. Yes, I. Good Let's singing. Say. So we Thank are one you. people. We are keeping yeah. the flame alive, and we yeah. will storm Africa with our Pan Africanist mm-hmm. message, hoping mm-hmm. that all Africans, especially the mm-hmm. youth, would hold mm-hmm. on to that and move mm-hmm. on into the next generation with positivity. Right. Thank you, love and respect. I highly appreciate the the words, power, and sound. Thank you so much for this. You know, good, good, good time. You, you, you. I I, t- I learn a lot. I will say ticking. So thank digital. you so much. <laughs> really. It's highly appreciated. And the energy is positive. I'm happy to be connected. Black Respect. Russia. All the way in the career. And then your protection yes. all the way. You know, because you have a heavy load. We all have a load. But some people, he- load is heavier, you know. Going with this coffee, Anan, General Trump, you know, M- Musavini, you know, <laughs> Mugabe, you know, Mugabe, <laughs> for Gaddafi, sorry. <laughs> yeah. I was like, Gaddafi, you don't have a song for Gaddafi, you know? I certainly have a song for Gaddafi. I have two songs for Gaddafi. All right. And one is so... called I Cry, the Libyan War. And the yes, other sir. one is Gaddafi, my hero. Mm-hmm. Yes. Thank that you. is the song. And it's yes. also big. You can check it up on YouTube. It is mm-hmm. there. Gaddafi, my hero. Yes. Ah. Wicked. 
Good. Me, I'm very happy Hurry. to have you here. Then I will be playing your music. I already killed that one hour, but thank you for the time and the love and the energy. We are connected. I will get back to Stephanie. And anytime, anything you want to present for me to out here is my small platform. I'm trying to move on. People like you out there from Gold Coast, it's a pleasure and I salute. Yeah. Um, yeah. Thank you. Thank Respect. you so much. I'll, I will be playing the... You are tough, my brother. One big I love. I salute you, sir. <laughs> Thank you. I will be playing music for the people. Big up everybody. Else. Them not care, them just a want you take the man. Voice of black them not want no black man from the land. Why you kill them each and every day? <laughs> and to try, I will run my head. Free my music. people, them <laughs> not no pray. Oh, my black Next people, 10 minutes for you, people, okay? Black, black people, people. they am shooting every day. Racist, Racist white man, coming like a holy man. That one is called Racist ah, Uniform. Them. Check out that yeah. song here on our My digital Lord platform, yeah. Black Rasta. You don't oh, live no, and direct no, to no, Yes, no, 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 no. And remember, you can ah, get them, all yeah. the songs in all digital My platforms, yeah. Black Listen this. Black Rasta is called B L A K K Rasta R A S T A. Check it out. Check all the songs out there. It's a great artist, great musician, all the way from Gold Coast. That was Mama intro. Let me give you something else from Black Rasta before we go. Lots and lots of music. Allah shifts the narrow to me. Ma, I do not know. Enjoy the last minute. I'm going to stop it there, play you one video. All right, this is a special one. All right. Vampires are for fierce and parasites. Uruguay! Rest in peace, former Alpha Dalpit, my hero. I cry! Black Rasta music, check it out. I 
I got six minutes with you. Be happy. Oh, 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 Black was my brother, my father, and my friend. Oh, why can I feel? Yes, so tell me why and how and who. Oh, why can I feel? He was a man so strong and bold. Oh, why can I feel? So bless me like Brahman Mirahim. Oh, why? Black they were the best of friends, Zapateri, Berlusconi, and Sarkozy of France. What do they Eat, do? dine, and boonga boonga, and flock together, they did like birds. Handshakes of treachery, hypocrisy, and jealousy soon flooded the press. Popular uprising in Tunisia, Syria, and Egypt rusted the nest. I got five they minutes to rats go, so and let's enjoy the video. To rebel video. against Gaddafi and cause <laughs> a blunder of historical mess. Yeah. In a twinkle of an eye, the eating, the dining, and the boonga boonga must be suppressed. And the best put together to rest, having been replaced by drones from America, Italy, France, and the rest. <laughs> huh. yes, sir. What a shame! Oh. It's a shame! So I'm gonna stop that there right away and I play you next video. Before then, one more song from Black I don't know. We get four minutes to go. Black let your arise and let all the enemies scatter. Yeah. All them was we hide under religion and make the people them drink some little dirty bit of gin. Run them out, Jaja. 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 In a my land, no just a spirit. No for perishing, will I get my weaving. With my car girls from San Isa Forest. The pretty girls so that's the man I bear. In a my land, blood just a spilling. No for perishing, all of them are willing. Bring us the girls from San Isa Forest. The pretty girls so that's the man I bear. Some people say that they do it in the name of Islam. But ah, the vast majority say they are just atheists on the land. Others say these guys are anything apart from Christian. Like the rest sit back with a shock and say they are only pagan. Whatever you claim you are, bring back the peace plan. Yeah. Free of the no. innocent girls from the surface of forest yes, so they can again see the sun. God. Remember that nobody lives forever, father or son. Yeah. And there is judgment after that for both man and woman. <laughs> In my land, blood just a spill. No for perishing, all of them are willing. Yeah. Bring back our girls from San Isa Forest. The pretty Pull up, listen this last video before me go. That is a new African in the world. Thank you all for tuning in. This is the African in the world. And I'm alone. The black man is coming from managing the world. I'm gonna give us up on a tour of Ethiopia. Yeah. Tour of the Marcos, Bahadur, Tuax, yeah. 
Solana Two. Greetings. Hundred trees, hundred millions and many more. They were back like fish in a jam and shifted on TV show. Yes, I. They too black magic and a shunt is golden stool. What are they? Oh yes, we wet the plantations and never get no pay. Yes, I. It's a full time no visit to the school. And it was a black master. It's a full time no, but people should know. Africa, you know what you see. Africa, you know what you see. Mama, Africa, you know what you see. Africa, you know what you see. You see a nation without any mystery. It's like a tree with a root. Yeah, that kind of tree could never be enough for my Africa. Yeah. Before we dance a brown, we can live to dance a yard. Because if I had room, could only tear us apart. Yes, the time has come for I and I to I and I. Last of the time, I'm going to stop all the fighting. I've been through the struggle and your story dream. So much agony, it and is so all much pain. Yeah, Yo, as a people, we must live in peace and harmony. The wicked PFS man has sat the rank and file with anarchy. Papa was slaughtered like a boy yeah. in a butchery. Mama was raped like a whore in total misery. Bumaye, Bumaya. Bumaye, Bumaya. Chase them out cause them too filthy. No brack, no brack. Strike them out just like them cause of blasphemy. Them desecrate the holy lands at Timbuktu, Lalibela. Duri Gaga, Gaga Duri. Chase them out. Out of Duri Gaga, Gaga Duri, Duri Gaga. Gaga Duri, Duri Gaga, Gaga Duri. Africa, you Rasta, now they are back again. Anchor, Missy Wangwano, now I would be a mole. In Africa, we sit on gold, yet we never gain. Here, man, we sit on diamond, yet we go to pain. Got the Chinese man, teeth with diamond, gold and tin, and only laugh and drink champagne. I want these leaders who say that we leaders, ugly bitches, we and feel no shame. African people are eating more Chinese food now than the other one planting. Chinese man, guns down the images, just like the one insane. Be everywhere you go now, black people, petrol and cheap Chinese imitation like sugar cane. No one can know the churches in Africa sing Chinese hymns and I am up to you. stopping it out there thank you all for your time and energy yo big up stephanie you have another video <laughs> okay i would say thank you for this special you know great artist all the way from ghana thing called black rasta watch him out there it's called b l a k k black rasta good artist check him out there i don't know Yes, beautiful people, thanks for your time and energy. Remember, we're there back next Thursday with Jar Walks. We keep the vibes alive. Many great artists in coming. Giddy Morning is coming. You get Half Pine, it's coming. You get Admiral Tibet, it's coming. You get Meta from the Corners, Meta and the Cornerstone coming. You get Sunslay, many artists. I can't name you all. I obtain. Yo, <laughs> all right. Think of Let's Talk from 8 p.m. every thursday to sunday we keep the vibes alive thank you all for your time and energy let's keep the vibes alive stay positive and healthy anywhere you are in this world we say love and lots of love thank you i'm out <laughs> yes i
Good. Black Rasta that have lots of music. I could just intro fast, fast here, and then you know you hear some of his music. From the depth of my heart, I shoot a cupid arrow to your soul. On the mighty throne of my love, you sat. Now you say you want to left me so. Remember, old friends are the best. Just as the world room shakes, every man are better. Baby, you were my brother, and I was your first. Now you say what God put you in, you are a starter. Sure. Just from your eyes, keep on falling. Cause you are leaving. Leaving with another. Things that we've done together. I'll always remember Stephanie, I would give you one video and I'm out I've done everything no one can do oh. I said in a word no one can say Come on! When that we make a go I'm an African king, you're my African queen, baby. You are so beautiful. The way you walk, the way you talk, my girl. You are so beautiful. I want you in my world, and I want you as my girl, baby. You are so beautiful. The way you walk, the way you talk, my girl. You are so beautiful. Baby, do you wanna be mine? Pull up that I'm gonna stop it right there. Give you one more song and one more video. You know? It was in 1992 when prosperity brought us together. I was only a toddler as compared to your huge international stature. Your humility and love broke and tore your enemies asunder. You rocked Niger reggae so hard it sounded like thunder. Rest in peace and all we love ones. I'm gonna play you a very last video called Cameroon and I'm out. Thank you. Make Africa the heaven that is supposed to be.
I'm gonna stop it right there. I think call Cameroon, Cameroon. Check it out on all digital platform. That was Black Rasta Life and directing call. Let's talk. Thank you all for taking your time and energy sharing the vibes. Think call. Stay healthy, stay positive, and be safe anywhere you are. One love, world peace. I'm out. Think call. Let's talk. Love and lots of love. Thank you, beautiful people. Yes, sir. See you next Thursday, 8 p.m. on. We